In Dallas, Parkland Hospital has been administering the vaccine at some of its sites since 7.30 this morning. Nicole is live now. So, Nicole, what are parents saying? Karen, of course, parents who showed up to get their kids vaccinated today were eager to do so. In some cases, they say it did take some bribing, but Wintrell Maiden knows exactly what it's like to have COVID. That's why her daughter was happy to get her first shot. Um, I think it's beneficial. The research behind it is strong. So I feel it was something that she needed on the first day. So I've been, I was stalking websites all night last night, trying to get her in somewhere. So this is because of like my family and stuff, making sure they're not getting sick. And I also had like family members get really sick or even pass away from this disease. So I've always been so nervous about that. The mother and daughter were among the first to line up at the Ellis Davis Field House in Dallas today. They say everyone in their household is either fully vaccinated or on their way. Summers, Kaylin says, will look a lot different this year because she and all of her friends are getting vaccinated and can finally sign up for summer camp. Dallas County health officials continue to urge families to get the vaccine. They say to moms and dads who question if the vaccine is safe to look at the science behind it and the results from it. It's six states now have achieved 70% uh, of the adult population being vaccinated. And now collectively in those uh, six states, I think there's a total of 18 deaths now in the last week for all of those states. A parent or a guardian is required in order for a child to get the vaccine. You must accompany that child unless you are using the Dallas County bus services through the Dallas ISD system. In that case, the child must have the proper permission slips. That service begins on Monday, but I can tell you Fair Park opens up its uh, Pfizer lines to 12 and 15 year olds tomorrow. That's the very latest from Dallas. Nicole Jacobs, CBSN. CBSN DFW.